Let's dive into a simple English lesson on the present simple tense, which is used for routines and general facts. Lesson, present simple tense. We use the present simple tense to talk about habits, routines, and facts. The structure is straightforward. For most subjects, I, you, we, they use the base form of the verb. For third person singular subjects, he, she, it, add s or es to the base form. Example, she reads every morning. Exercises. Fill in the blanks. Complete the sentences with the correct form of the verb in parentheses. He like to play soccer on weekends. They go to school by bus. True or false? Determine if the statements are true or false. A. She go to the gym every day. B. We usually watch TV in the evening. C. True or false? Create sentences using the present simple tense with the words provided. A. She slash read slash book. B. Absolutely. If you said I goes, I'd gently correct you like this. Actually, in English, we say I go for the present simple tense. We use the base form of the verb with I, so it's I go. Here are some great free apps for English beginners. One, Duolingo, fun bite-sized lessons with gamified learning. Perfect for vocabulary and basic grammar. Two, BBC Learning English offers video and audio lessons with real life situations. Three, Hello English, great for beginners with interactive games and activities. Four, Buzu includes beginner lessons, speaking practice, and interactive quizzes. Five, LingQ provides audio and text lessons so you can practice listening and reading. Uh, these apps offer a solid mix of practice styles to keep things engaging. Want details on free it? apps to take your skills up a notch? One, Memrise focuses on vocabulary and phrase with native speaker videos to improve comprehension. Two, Quizlet. Create or use flashcards to review grammar rules, idioms, or tricky words. Three, Bilinguap. Read stories in English side by side with your native language to improve reading skills. Four, TED. Watch engaging talks with subtitles and transcript options to enhance listening. Five, Hello Talk. Practice with native speakers through text or voice chat while learning natural conversation. These apps help bridge the gap.